Godzilla King of Monsters. All right, uh, add stream marker. Hello and welcome to the Icoria Early Access Event with me, your host, Barty Punker. I have been gifted an account loaded with all the cards that are going to be legal and future standard by Wizards of the Coast. So everything here that you see is 100% because Wizards of the Coast uh, kind of likes me sometimes. So, so that's cool. Uh, that being said, what are we doing? We're going to... Did the update give us a Grazer style? I have some bad news. <laughs> uh, this deck is... We're calling it Dragon Mutation. Um, we're trying to get some Planeswalkers. Literally, this is the goal of the deck. This is what I built this deck. Katal asked me to do this. Where is Grazer as Godzilla? We, we want to get Sarkin into play. We want to plus one him with some other Planeswalkers. And then we want to mutate onto one of the Planeswalkers. That is our only goal. If we lose every game we play, it doesn't matter. As long as we can do that is... Is that, is that the bottom of my green screen? That's the bottom of my green screen. Let's... Uh, boop. Ha ha! The magic. There we go. Everything's fine. We want to turn walkers into creatures. That is our only goal. Uh, so our mutations, we have Glowstone Recluse. It's a four mana uh, mutate. Whenever it mutates, put two counters on it. This might just be a three drop, honestly. Uh, we have Porcu Parrot, which is just the most fantastic card ever. Uh, it mutates. That's the only thing that matters. But, like, look at that art. Who cares what it does? <laughs> Uh, we have uh, Gem Razor or Ang Angurus Armored Killer. When it mutates, this could be good. This is a good utility one. Uh, when this one mutates, we ramp. And then we have this to just like flute big stupid things into play and, and draw more cards, basically. We have some ramp. We have little kills, kill spells, and planeswalkers. Let's do it. Is better Brontodon. Ooh. Let's let's just get in here and see what happens. The real question is, is he a Porky Planeswalker or a Sarka Parrot? <laughs> We're about to find out. Oh yeah, I got the Does this look like uh Ryan Reynolds to anyone else? Like an old Ryan Reynolds? I have. I'm gonna move it. All right. Um, this is kind of awkward, but we'll keep it. And then we will bottom. Chandra. Yeah, sure. Like this is like old man Ryan Reynolds with with some face paint. That wasn't the goal. We have one singular goal, and we're going to do it. I can feel it in my bones. Oh, that was a good draw. This was a good draw, because that means we get to mutate Grazer next turn. Y'all ready to see what a, a mutation looks like? Whenever this creature mutates, destroy target, artifact, or enchantment, and opponent controls. I mean, it's not the best mutation, but it is a 4-4 four, four for 3, basically. So if I play this, no, I don't have that. Okay. Oh, look at that. It's all fancy. Play that. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't you essence scatter me now. I hate you. I'll be honest, we put Aether Gust in one of our decks because there's a lot of stuff that gets hit by it. Riddle's face is just so grumpy right now. You know what's happening, don't you, bud? I need to update my pet because this, this common owl will not suffice. 
It won't even let me. Oh, there we go. Where's the black one? There's the black one. All right, so we get to stomp this. I think I'm going to stomp and then just play Bone Crusher out. Yeah, exactly. I don't even have ultimatums in my decks at the moment. Oh, they've changed what this looks like. You've redecorated. I hate it. Um, oh, these even look slightly different, like, in play. Huh. Do I do this... So if I do, no, I'm just gonna put a 4-3 in play. 4-3 is better than an 0-3, so. Yeah, I'm not saying it looks bad. I'm just making a, a joke, a yoke. There's a, uh, there's, it's a Doctor Who meme of just like, oh, you've redecorated. I don't like it. <laughs> Are they about to play Sarkin? I don't think they're going to play Sarkin. No! Wait. Wait, if we draw a green source, does this work how I want it to? We don't draw a green source. It doesn't matter. Is there a way I can cast this? Oh, no. I, like, frankly don't know how any of these mechanics work. Okay, cool. We would have been able to boop, boop. Oh, that was special. No, stop it. Does the three dots in the bottom left corner do anything other than tell you that the creature... I think it just says that the creature has text. That's what I was clicking on before. I was like, what are the three dots? I was hoping it meant, like... There's more text than you can see. Oh, they're smart. They're protecting it from our murmured, our armored rusher thrasher. Come and destroy. All right, this this arboreal grazer is about to ping this to fairy for one. So are we really losing? Until they kill our Tefer or Dom Domri. I don't want to play this because I know this is here. Like, quite frankly, if they play this and hit Domri, I'm okay with that. Alright. And now we get to, to Armored Killer this thing away. Oh, they shocked. So Ether Gust again? Are you kidding me? Yeah, going to Domri first. Yeah, but the, it's going to be Ether Gust. It's not going to be a counter spell. Who plays counter spells anymore? Why would you? That's the problem with Ether Gust, right? It's not countering it. Oh, sure. Mutate. Uh, uh, over. You love to see it. Look at this thing. Look at the, like the little gems. No. <laughs> Why are you even asking? You know I can't mutate. Look, we're we're gonna play this deck until we mutate a planeswalker, but I don't think we're doing it this game. That which appears is merely the result of practice. Strike with a Alright, alright, alright. Let's let's move on. They've beaten us. Come after me, wizards. I conceded before they did the thing. <laughs> All right, we can do this. <laughs> it's fine. Everything is fine. They they did the thing, right? They're a control deck. They were controlling me. I was upset. 
That's how it works, right? Ooh, they, they have themselves a, a, a companion. Um, this is a really expensive hand. This is better. Keep bottoming Chandra. Probably, probably points to not needing her in my deck. What does this one do? Only even cards. Okay. So, so they're playing even Paladin. Ooh, we get to ramp next turn and hit for three. I threw away the combo. Look, we drew one. It's fine. Everything is fine. Uh, over. Always over. Uh, yeah, we'll get another mountain. Gosh, that's so good. Gosh, that's so good. I love Mutate. Mutate is great. Look at these. They're using the Ikoria basics. I'm like a shill, so I'm not. Look at the oh, that's not. That's I'm disappointed, opponent. Thassa's Oracle. Let's mutate again. Um, where are you going? What are you doing? No, you're not supposed to be in my lap. You're supposed to, you're supposed to be on camera. He's in my lap. With four Jim I mean, Jim Razor's not bad. Blinky, blinky. Don't blink. Blink and you'll miss it. All right. So next turn, we Domri kill this. Incendium with the the five month resub. Happy happy Ikoria early access to you too. Uh, hold on. So if I play this... I can plus. Oh, I goofed up. I thought I was... I was thinking about this wrong. I hecked up. I'm sorry, chat. I disappointed you. This should be dead. Yeah, I really hecked that up. It looks like a plantain. Yeah, I could have just played a giant. You're right. But I didn't. I hacked everything up. All right. It's okay. This is just my lo long con of uh, drawing the Sarkin. <laughs> like, when should my opponent concede? Because, like, what if I just sit here and wait to draw the Sarkin? Someone needs to remind me after this match to update my pet. This is fight, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Ooh, they can bring Dream Eater back and really blow us out because we've been stacking on this thing. Buddy. Buddy. They want you to be in the bed, not in my lap. Karuga. Oh, you mean Jiruta? Yeah, sure. Oh, they get to do it again? No! Jiruta. Jiruta, why you like this? Uh, uh, that's a Sarkin. They milled a Sarkin, chat. Look how many cards they drew us, huh? God, they did it twice. 
So, I could have, I, I goofed up for sure. I can't really do a whole lot here, huh? Jim uh, Razor. <laughs> this is so bad. We're pretty dead. This doesn't have text here. Oh my gosh, they're doing it again. They're doing it again, chat. My poor, my poor babies. Aha, we're gonna mill them out. They only have 22, oh God. Wait, what is happening? Oh, they have spark doubles that they're bringing back. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> there, I didn't concede. <laughs> All right, obviously the issue is our, our pet selection, right? All right, uh, profile, pet select. Wait, there's a different cat? Like, I have a ZZ. I didn't know this thing was it. it does it make the same terrible noise that this one makes? This one sounds like a cat is dying in the other room, and it really upsets me. I'm sorry y'all can't see Riddle. What if I, is it awkward to just like, there he is, he's on my lap. <laughs> all right, all right, we have turn one Grazer into turn two Great Horn. Senor Cheese with the follow. Welcome to stream. Thank you very much. Oh, we have a Sarkin. Are we doing it? We might be doing it. What is their thing? Yes, I want all the lands. Oh, yes. Turn to Domery for sure. And that way, it'll have... It'll be able to be mutated on. We won't answer to other guilds. Eh, it makes a similar noise. I'm a face. It's not as bad as the other one. All right, all right. Uh, so we do this. Get a land. Plus here. We won't answer now, the do this. Feel the heat of my <sighs> so they have... Bone Crushers in their deck. Fierce Ferrets rating us with 16. Welcome, everyone. The Ferret Squad is here. Hello, hello. My name is Marty Punker. 
I think because I want to do the thing, I'm going to plus here. My name is Marty Punker, and uh, we are currently playing in the IKO Early Access event. Our plan is to plus Sarkin and then mutate onto a Planeswalker. So, so get ready for that next turn. Bok, bok, bok. I'm having fun so far. Uh, oh gosh. Oh gosh. It's happening. All right. Okay, you're going back to, to the actual spot that I have for you and not just my lap, you crazy animal. Oh gosh, sorry, sorry. Oh, oh, this is a amateur protection. Here we have a cat in his wild habitat. Um, all right. So now that we're here, the thing happens. Uh, uh, uh. All right. So how does this work? Do we do it under or over? It's over, right? Over. Okay. We did it. We did it, chat. <laughs> All right, so we have a creature with Planeswalker abilities now. All right, I want to plus this. These are indestructible, right? No, they're not. They don't lose loyalty, but they would lose the fight, is my point. Oh, we could have killed the Reaper, sure. There we go. Wait, where are the where are the abilities? <laughs> That's funny. What does this do? If a source you control with an odd converted mana cost would deal damage to a permanent or a player, it deals double that damage instead. Yikes. All right, so we're taking six. Uh, this one. Wait, it doesn't have flying because it's a creature. So let's try under this time. <laughs> uh, this is so silly. <laughs> it is a judge's test. That is hilarious. So it's a creature that still has abilities, but because it's a creature, Sarkin's plus one doesn't change it. Okay, I have to change away from the cat. I don't like the noises. I'm sorry. Pet the cat. I would gladly pet the cat. Hey, bud. <laughs> I don't know if he's glad about it, but... All right. Gotta celebrate you. Let's play one more, but I don't think it gets much better than that, right? So I think if you want to keep using the ability... Oh, Ben Engineering. Nice. Uh, this is Ben for Ben Ulmer from Loading Ready Run. So if you want to if you want to keep doing the Sarkin thing, you want to go under. <laughs> Pet the cat will continue until morale improves. <laughs> Who's morale? Is it his morale? Like, look at this guy. <laughs> Uh, that's awkward that it's a tap land, but I'm going to keep it. All right. Let's see what we got. 
What's our boy been up to? Some uh, Timor? Self mill teamer, you say? Uh, I'm listening. Um, I'm gonna ramp a little here. So next turn we get to Sarkin. Please don't bounce my three four. Please don't bounce my three four. Please don't brazen borrow my 3-4. Please don't do it, Ben. Ben, I'm begging you. You're a red mage. Okay. Fires of Invention. Oh my gosh. What is this spicy meatball? Song of Creation. Underworld Breach. I said Fires of Invention. I'm in Underworld Breach. Lucky Clover. Next turn, chat. Next turn, we get to Parrot. <laughs> we get to Parrot our Sarkin. And that that's really what we want to do, let's be honest. Squack. <laughs> it squawks and like fire spurts out. But memes. But memes. <laughs> oh, there he he's just putting Uro into play. It's fine. It's fine. It's just an Uro. So we plus Sarkin. Do we want to pair it? We kind of want to pair it. Okay, fine. Parrots are funnier. <laughs> Let's do it again. Oh, I'm very much a liability. I did put them both under. You're right. I, But he would have been a 3-4, and I would have been sad. Now they just kill it. Sure. But he would have been a 3-4, and I would have been sad. Listen to them roar. Listen to them roar. Uh, mutate post-combat. Good point, good point. Ah, that's neat. We aren't here to win. Let's be honest. With this deck... <laughs> we can attack with a 6-6 six, six next turn? We can have a 6-6 six, six of our own. I bet you it's sweet. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm gonna let him. I'm gonna. He's got some like cool self mill stuff going on. Underworld breach is going. I'm here for this. All right. All right. Um, I want the dragon on top. Make myself a 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, I agree. This, this is taking me a little bit to get used to, but now that I've played with it a little bit, I, I don't even really notice. Fine. 
flying with reach. I know, I love it. <laughs> Go, go, gadget, chump blocker. Hey, hello. Fleshy gnome raiding me with a party of seven. Welcome, everyone. Welcome to the Ikoria early access event, Marty Punker style. We are currently uh, meme versus meme here. <clears throat> No! I'm gonna take action because it puts the mutations on top. Yeah. So we still get to mutate onto here. Oh, I love how it does that. That's so good. Yeah, definitely under. I love how it like lifts it up and then slides it in it's so good it's so good i hope i hope you had a good stream fleshy gnome gosh it's funny because while i was at work waiting for this to happen when i was at work wait, waiting to come home to do this i was like you know i've never been raided before that's really weird now it's twice today Okay, Song of Creation. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay. Let's do it, Ben. Show me what you got. For, for all the newcomers, this is my cat, Riddle. Uh, he is the star of the show. Add one man of any color, draw two cards. And we got a pet the cat redemption. Hey, bud. Hey, bud. I know you're taking a bath, but this is what chat wants. This is what chat wants. <laughs> Sometimes I think he doesn't like you, chat. <laughs> one, one man of ritual, draw two. Yeah. I have a song creation deck that is very different from from this. Oh, Lucky Clover. Oh, that's cute. So you pay one, and then you get three off of this. You draw two cards, put a land into play. So yeah, it's basically a dark ritual. A dark ritual that gets you any color. Oh man, now it's now it's better than a dark ritual. Now it's just a dark ritual, sorry. I, I'm i thinking this has Uro text, is why I'm being dumb. Yeah, and they're just fueling Breach with Song. This deck is very cool. Going, going to auto pass through turn. Let Ben do the thing. I don't think my my song of creation. Oh, it's my turn, huh? I don't think my song of creation deck is this cool. No cosplay, right? <laughs> I, I, yeah. All oh, right, I cosplayed as Robber of the Ridge. What did I do for Theros? I didn't do anything for Theros, did I? Cards in their deck is six, and we have 42. Yeah, my first cosplay, Sh Chandra. <laughs> I still have them. They're like all the way across the apartment, and I don't want to miss this. All right, all right. Underworld Breach, draw two cards, and then they cast. So they have one, two, three, four. Yeah, so they cast Thassa's Oracle, and we die. They just have to make two 
blue mana, so if they have another um, Rose Thorn Acolyte, they've got it. Cool. Yeah, so if Rose Thorn was in their graveyard, so they cast this, and then they filter off of these into double blue. Is this what card is something like that? This was very cool. I'm glad he got to pop off. Dark Ritual. What a great card in Proof Yogsville, right? Yeah, it's closer to Cabal Ritual, right? If you get enough of these out, it's Cabal. And we're dead. All right. I think I'm going to move on to a different deck because we've done the thing multiple times. Nah. I, I don't take anything from these events. They're just, like, really fun decks. Um, this was, like, very hastily thrown together to do specifically one thing, and that was to mutate Sarkin, and we did that, so I'm pretty happy. So we're going to move on. Um, in terms of, like, what I thought was good in the deck... This card's actually pretty sweet. There are a lot of artifacts and enchantments that you want to kill. And this is just like a 4-4 four, four Trampler for 3 that you can play on turn 2 off of like Par or, uh, Arboreal Grazer or Land of War Elves in Historic. So I actually really like this card. 